Jericho, when King Herod ruled Judea, now part of Israel, God sent the angel Gabriel to a young woman who lived in the northern town of Nazareth. The girl's name was Mary, and she was engaged to marry Joseph. The angel Gabriel said to Mary, Peace be with you. God has blessed you and is pleased with you. Mary was very surprised by this and wondered what the angel meant. The angel said to her, Don't be afraid. God has been very kind to you. You will become pregnant by the Holy Spirit and give birth to a baby boy, and you will call him Jesus. He will be God's own son, and his kingdom will never end.
Barbarian Joseph lived was part of the Roman Empire. The Roman Emperor Augustus wanted to have a list of all the people in the empire to make sure that they were paying their taxes. He ordered everyone to return to the towns where their families originally came from and enter their names into a census. Mary and Joseph traveled a long way, about 115 kilometers from Nazareth to Judea, then to Bethlehem, where Joseph's family was originally from. They traveled, they traveled very slowly with the help of a donkey, because Mary, Mary's baby, was due to be born soon.
Many people had come to register their names in the census, so every house was filled and every bed was taken with all the inns. The only shelter that they could find was the cave, where they stabled animals. In this humble place, Mary gave birth to Jesus, the Son of God. He was laid in the manger where the animals ate from. Judea. During the time of the King Herod, 
Magi from the east came from Jerusalem, asking, Where is this newborn king of the Jews? We saw his star as it rose, and we had come to worship him. King Herod was deeply disturbed when he heard this, as was everyone in Jerusalem. King Herod told the Magi, told the Magi to go to Bethlehem and search carefully for the child, so that he could worship him too. But this was a lie. King Herod planned to destroy or kill the baby. The star in the east guided the Magi to Bethlehem, where baby Jesus was. They entered the house and saw the child with Mary, and they bowed down and worshipped him. Then they opened their treasure chests and gave the gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. After this, the wise men returned to their country by another route, as they had been warned in a dream not to go back to King Herod as he planned to kill the baby. Thank you. 
Frankfurt Pro.